From WCPO 9, it's a new day. Good morning and welcome back. For this segment, we want to focus our attention on addressing the problem. I am joined by Cincinnati Realtor Dariq Dansby to talk about the low income housing crisis. What have you been seeing to address the problem? Well, we all have just a low income housing. We have a housing crisis period. Mm. Um, unfortunately, Myra, we just do not have enough inventory to keep up with the demand of the number of individuals and families who are looking to live in the city and within the surrounding neighborhoods. Um, there's been a lot done to try to help that. Most recently, the city has been working on passing connected communities in effort to increase density. Uh, but to be honest with you, we just don't have enough housing, period. And because the housing is so low, the housing prices are escalating rapidly. Unfortunately. And what have you guys been doing to address the problem? Well, we've been supporting connected communities, but we've also been trying to encourage the city to be uh, more inclusive of including more developers at building more buildings, at easing some of the red tape and some of the restrictions and tightening up some of the timeline it takes to actually take the bill uh, the dense to, to build those properties and to build those homes and those apartment buildings and whatnot. Um, so it's, it's going to be a long process, unfortunately. I understand. Now, I understand you guys are having an event soon. Yes. Tell us about it. So we're, um, we've been working on trying to increase the African American home ownership rate for quite some time. Uh, within the city of Cincinnati, uh, it's lower than 25%. Countywide, it's 33%. Unfortunately, that's 40% lower than the white home ownership rate na nationwide. Um, so what we're doing is we're trying to educate as the many families and individuals as we can on how to become a homeowner, um, as well as maintaining the individuals who are already in their home that own their home as well. It's really a two-prong approach. So we're doing a huge event called Own Black Cincy. It's a two-day housing event. The first day is more focused on um, best practices. Um, with industry professionals like myself and others. But there's also a day two, which is a very comprehensive program. Um, it's got 20 different workshops, all focused on whether you're planning to buy a home, shopping for a home, looking to maintain the home that you're in, or if you're looking to make further real estate investments using the equity that you already have in your home. Well, that's amazing. Now, I know that recently it seems that it is a lot cheaper to own a home than it is to rent. I know you've probably been seeing that trend, too. So what advice can you give people who are, you know, stuck in between that? I don't really I, I I'm more safe renting than owning. Yeah, well, the, the main thing is to get ready to put yourself in a position to own a home. It may, you may not be ready today. It may not be next week. But at some point, you need to get ready to make that next step. So that way, you're, the rising property values, the rising rent prices that we're seeing, if you're a homeowner, that can stabilize your budget. You know how much your mortgage is. You know how much you're going to pay. Uh, you won't have a landlord that's, that's going to raise your rent $100 or $200 every year. Yeah. So what we are in, encouraging individuals and families to do is to begin um, pulling your credit, begin saving money, begin working on your credit. Um, and begin to identify a lender as well as a realtor you can work with to help get you on that path to home ownership. Now, a lot of people worry that if they do own a home, they might get stuck, you know, like having to fix a washer or fix a roof or something like that. What advice can you give to people to kind of diminish their fear about that? Well, number one, during the home buying process, we always try to encourage individuals that even though you bought the home, continue to save, yeah. um, purchase a home warranty to help you in case appliances go break down or things like that. But also when, when those two things aren't in place, the city and the county uh, does provide a variety of different home repair services that can assist you with those things. Okay. And we'll be talking about a number of those grant opportunities that they have available at the Own Black Cincy Conference on June 28th and June 29th. Awesome. Well, thank you, Dariq. Now, where can people go to find more information and get the help that they need? Our website is uh, ownblackcincy.org. That's ownblackcincy.org. You can also find us on social media, Instagram um, and Facebook under Own Black Cincy as well. All right. We got to hit up social media, guys. Well, thank you so much for joining us today. Now, we have more in store for you all coming up right after the break. But first, we have some helpful resources and information about local organizations helping the homeless and hungry in the Tri-State. 